What's up everyone, Wet's work here, and guess what? I just, um, made a cool little custom last night. Only took me about ten minutes. Cat? L lay down. Good, just lay down. Of, um, a guy from The Last Jedi. And... Gonna show you him. Okay, this figure kind of sucks. Not gonna lie, it's not good. Let me look at that, but it's Snoke. You're probably like, what? what is this piece of trash that I'm looking at? Well, um, first of all, I think we need this. Second of all, cat! Yeah, so, um... This was once like a silence action figure from Doctor Who. You can probably tell because of the head. It's the only thing that relatively looks like Snoke. I had to use duct tape to hold it together. It was this bad guy cut up. I I colored like this part on. Tried to make this look like his belt. He can still move his arms. Bend his arms. Move his arms forward move his legs forward bend his knees still has all the articulation that action figure had except he's covered with this bag and yes it, it's very bright and now he's gonna stand beside Kylo he has a good a, a good Height compared to Kylo, which is good because I think Snoke is tall in the movie. I think, but yeah, this 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 wasn't meant to be good. It's supposed to hold me off until I get the Black series, and it's totally reversible. But it. It looks good for what it is. I, I did say I did this in 10 minutes. 10 minutes. This was 10 minutes. Ah, uh, heard that. That was, um, my mouth. My mouth just cracked. Ah. Uh, ah. But yeah. It's kind of a little too bright. There we go. See, you're probably like, um, no, this isn't the greatest figure, but I mean, like I said, it's holding me off to the Black Series in place, yeah, it's pretty cool. I did like Snoke in the movie, the scenes that he was in were really cool. Wish he was in it more. Most likely everyone who's watching this video has seen The Force, so, not The Force Awakens, the Last Jedi, and knows how this, how kind of disappointing Snoke was, but how his, like, ship was, like, so awesome. Not to tell you something. They could, if Snoke decided to send three dreadnoughts to the Resistance base instead of trying to blow it up with Starkiller base. Hold on. Yeah, if Snoke sent like three dreadnoughts to the resistance base instead of trying to blowing it up with star killer base you probably could destroy the resistance i mean the dreadnought like totally destroyed the rebel base that was one so yeah um mm -hmm. could have ended it all but yeah i like this snoke is this some it's only really good looking from the front because you get to the back and you see all this trash. That's just to hold it together. But you can still move his head a little bit. Can rotate his arms, which is pretty good. Can do the upper arm rotation, single jointed elbow with rot new rotation, and then you can rotate his hands. Still rotate his waist, move the legs forward, back, 
bend, rotate, all that kind of good stuff that the silence has. I like try to hide the suit and tie from the silence. It wasn't fun because cutting a bag. Now here's the thing. Did it in ten minutes. Had scissors, duct tape. That was it. And I managed to make this. It's pretty cool. I didn't have like intricate stitching to make to be able to keep it on him. I didn't have any of that. I just had the figure. And then the bag. The scissors, the sharpies, the tape. And for what it is, this it's pretty cool. It holds up pretty well. Probably gonna enforce it with some more tape. Probably paint over the tape. Just you know in the areas that really need it. I can't use this bag ever again. Sucks. And again, that bag's like really old out. It already had holes in it. Anyone guess what it was holding? If you guessed Clone Wars figures, you were right. Yeah, I, gra I specifically grabbed the white Clone Trooper plain one because uh, that's cool. Yeah. Again, I like putting him beside Ren. Because I'm like 100% sure that this guy's tall. I want to get two Praetorian guards though. Not Gamorrean, like I said one time. In my first video that I mentioned them, I said Gamorrean guards. Because I thought that's how you said it. It's Praetorian. Now I know. I thought it was Praetorian. I don't know. Anyway. Yeah, I, I just got home. Rocking the Nike jacket, yeah, yeah, cause I couldn't find my Stormtrooper one. I seriously can't think of where it could be, my room. My room, I, I just don't know, I just, I just, I just, I just don't know. But yeah, the, this, remember back videos ago I said that February, I was going to do a bunch of Black Panther reviews. Have you noticed how there's been only two reviews related to Black Panther? I know, I, I live up to my word. Well, you know, whenever there's a $5 at at Trooper, you can't, you can't pass that up, man. You can't pass that up. And I just saw The Last Jedi, and I'm like, oh, yeah, uh-huh, you know what it is. <laughs> yeah, I was, like, into it, and I was like, yeah, got, gotta catch them all. And then I was like, oh wait, Black Panther is coming up. I've noticed these. I've noticed a lot of things that are weird lately. So yeah, I will try to get the basic figures. I can't find that Shuri. I can't find it. I mainly find Black Panther, which is kind of good. Because, oh my god, Spider-Man Homecoming... The regular Spider-Man suit was near impossible to find. Which is odd, because, you know, should be the easiest to find, because it's the regular Spider-Man, but no, the pegs are just covered with vultures. Probably because it's kind of a disappointing figure. I mean, the wings aren't as huge, he's only, he's only 5 POA. But, I mean, yeah. Good to see that there's a lot of Black Panthers. But I think the Shuri has become the Spider-Man because I can't find her. I don't know why she's so hard to find. Because if anything, most like the little kids want to get Black Panther, not Shuri. So why is she so hard to find? I don't know. I think that's her name, Shuri. Is it Shuri? I think. I think so. I'm not good with the Wakanda names. It took me like forever to realize his name's T'Challa. Then. T'Chaka. I was like, is that really his name? I don't know. But yeah. Why am I talking about Black Panther in a, a Snoke custom video review? I don't know. But yeah, that this is Snoke. If you if you have a yellow bag, a silence action figure, duct tape and scissors with a little bit of Sharpie, you can make a Snoke action figure. You also gotta be very smart. I wrapped it around him. 
a, like a lot. And then I caught a bunch of areas. I still managed to get him. Like, he can put his arms all the way out. Then you look underneath. It does show his armpits, his armpits. Yeah, but I mean, he, he's meant to sit in a throne. His non-existent throne. I probably should make him a throne. Part 2, coming up in three months when I actually decide to do it. Because, um, I'm lazy, and I don't want to, you know, make it. Besides, it's not like he is, it's not like he sits in the throne the entire movie or anything. <laughs> oh, wait, he does. I'm about to yell spoiler alert, like skip. Ten seconds and three. It's, if you haven't seen The Last Jedi, I suggest skipping one minute to like twelve. Like, skip all the way to twelve minutes if you don't want to hear a major spoiler about Snoke if you haven't already heard. Uh, and three, two, one. Okay, you've been warned. Um. How ironic, he sits in the chair all the time, and he dies in the chair. Mm-hmm. Goes out like Palpatine. First movie appears as a giant hologram. Second, he does nothing and dies. Let's get the rest of my Last Jedi figures in here. The Executioners are actually really cool in the movie. Let's just try to angle that light. Of course, my light is on the side with the um one person that doesn't need the light at all. Ah, welcome back. Yeah, that that's it for Snow Whack. I may update him, or I may just next time you hear something related to Snoke, I will um have the Black Series one. I want to get the one with the throne though. I don't want to get the Black Series one at all, though. I actually want to get the Elite Series. That one looks the best. Mmm, spicy. What? What am I talking about? Okay, again? Oh, yeah. Mmm, Snoke. I did actually cut up a plastic bag and make it out of... I made this entire thing out of a plastic bag before I actually made it out of the bag, like the yellow bag, because I only have two yellow bags, and I'm not cutting up that yellow bag, because it's from Do the Right Thing, more like Do the Piece of Trash Junk, why do I have to write an essay? Can I just win the computer already? Yeah, I have a lot of complaints about that Do the Right Thing, more like Get Picked Last to go and eat, and then when you go to get food, there's no food, when they said there's endless food to feed you all, and then you realize there's no food, and they're taking away the food, and you have to eat some darn wet turkey. I should grab three cookies. I should grab more than one cookie. What was I thinking? Yeah, I kind of let it go. Let it go! Yeah, uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I will um do another Last Jedi Lego video, and we'll definitely have Admiral Akbar in it because <laughs> <laughs> makes me cry every time I see it. I was thinking I may do a video dedicated to just that. So subscribe if you want to see more customs. Write down in the comments below if you want to see another custom figure. Write down in the comments below your choice for a custom figure because I'm planning on doing a lot of customs this year. First was Thanos. I wanted to do a red Hulk. I painted the Hulk's legs red. Never finished him. And now it's Snoke. So yeah, write down in the comments below if you want to see like a custom figure. And see y'all next time. Bye bye bye. Subscribe if you haven't already, please. That would help me out a lot. You know, we're almost at 21 subscribers, and then we'll do 